Hey, it's Ginger Boy. Welcome back to another episode of Modbox. This one is a very, very simple mod, but it changes the game very drastically. As you can see, it is a night right now, and I have a lantern in this chest. So, to craft it, you just need some iron ingots, a piece of glass, and some glowstone. In fact, I'm going to make it right now, just to show it off. And with this, you get a lantern. Well, what does the lantern do? When you hold it, it emits light dynamically around you. So you can take it wherever you want, the light follows you, and it's all so nice and pretty. Along with that, you can place them on the ground, you can place them upside down, hanging from different environmental objects, and all around have a nice time when cave exploring, because really, they just uh, create some light. You can also, in uh, survival, you can break them just by punching them like a torch no matter where you put them they just break for you so even though it's a very simple mod very not much to it because it is only this lantern it is very powerful especially with the dynamic lighting and being able to carry around a lantern with you this is a mod that would be very useful to have in the actual game. Um, the only thing that would make it better is some sort of hat, being able to put the lantern on a hat. But as you can see with the dynamic lighting every now and then, it will glitch in your game and create lighting where there is no actual source. And there's not really anything you can do to fix that except placing the lantern down and then breaking it to reset the lighting. But even then, it doesn't always work. So that is something to watch out for. It happens a lot more if you jump with it than if you just walk. But uh, it is a small, small bug small little bug to deal with especially with uh, having infinite light source and along with that even though it's a bug it seems to be a useful bug leaving light sources behind where they really shouldn't exist anyway that's really it for this mod very simple very straightforward but very useful all in all so if you want this mod Look in the description, it is another Forge mod for 1.7.2. Anyway, this has been Ninja Boy, and I will be back next week with another mod. See you guys then.